three. And now we come back to talk about the surrender of our burdens. No sooner did the high priest and temple guard see Jesus than they all shouted in a frenzy, crucify him, crucify him. And Pilate replied, you take him then and nail him to a cross yourselves. I told you, he's not guilty. I find no reason to condemn him. But they screamed out, take him away, take him away and crucify him. Pilate replied, shall I nail your king to a cross? Mm -hmm. The high priest answered, we have no other king but Caesar. Then Pilate handed Jesus over to them. So the soldier seized him and took him away to be crucified. Jesus carried his own cross out of the city to the place called the Skull, which is in Aramaic, Golgotha. Yes, and as we watch Jesus carrying the weight of his own cross, falling under the weight of it, we reflect ourselves. What heavy burdens are you carrying that have been placed on you by, by other people? What heavy burdens are you carrying that, that feel like they've been placed on you by God? What heavy burdens are you carrying that you may have placed on yourself? And in light of that, in what ways is God inviting you to surrender to his love for you? so that you can experience his rest in even your most overwhelming times. Compassionate God, mm -hmm. help us to surrender the weight of our burdens into your love, that our souls can experience the unforced rhythms of grace. Amen. Go now and listen to come as you are and worship this compassionate God. And then come back and join us for the next segment of this service. 